Good afternoon, subscribers, friends, family. Sunday afternoon, July 8th, Cal Oak and North, Philippines, baby. And uh, thanks for clicking that on Philo in the Philippines. I'm in the front of the house today because we're having a we're having a gate built uh, to keep Natty, you know, from going to the backyard. Uh, I showed you guys that little cheesy fence that we built. And it's just it, it's just not good enough. She's already strong enough that she can push that fence over. Uh, and she's gotten in the backyard a couple of times, so we need to do something better. Uh, Philippines news. Uh, what's going on in the Philippines? On Friday, the government here in Manila raised the minimum jeepney fare from eight pesos to nine. So the jeepney drivers in Manila got a raise. Good for them, right? Uh, what else is going on? Uh, we have a typhoon, okay, on the western side of the islands. It's moving its way up towards southern Japan right now. Typhoon Maria. They're calling it as strong or powerful as Yolanda. And uh, we all remember what Yolanda did to the Philippines. Although Yolanda did make a direct hit, you know, in Leyte. Uh, this one's not doing the same, but it's, it's the same physical force that Yolanda was. So we are hunkering down for a couple of days here, maybe 48 to 72 hours of rain. And Melanie and I made a, a run to the Palenque, which is, is going to be the next video. And not, not not this video, but it's going to be the next video. The video I have for you today is just of the several shopping options that we have in the uh, uh, subdivision. And the Tagalog phrase of the day is, Meron ba kayo? Meron ba kayo? Do you have? Of course, this is going to come in handy when you are at the Linke shopping, or you're at the Sorry Sorry store shopping, or the hardware store, do you have such and such? Now later on, um, as we begin to run out of phrases, we're gonna add words. I'm gonna add, you know, various words into the uh, Tagalog lessons, and then we'll bring these phrases back and combine those with the new words that we're gonna learn, okay? So uh, that's gonna be great for all of us. And uh, thanks for watching Follow in the Philippines. Give me a thumbs up, share the videos, tell your friends, subscribe. Thank you so much. And signing off from Kelokan North. Thank you so much. Good morning. How's everybody doing? <clears throat> Friday morning, July 6th. Morning, Vic. How you doing? I wanted to uh, show you guys just how many stores, small stores there are right here in, in our little in our little area, just here in the extension. So this one is where the kids buy all their candy. And that is that is actually an OSHA approved uh, door stop there. Oh, chef fruit. This is uh, another sorry, sorry store here. This lady makes french fries, all kinds of stuff. And our neighbor Vic right here, that's his store. That's where we buy a lot of our red horse. Go. Good morning. And this one. RC Cola Specialist. JJ, how are you doing, buddy? Good to see you. And this one, where we buy our water and charcoal. What's up, buddy? How, How you doing? doing? Good, man. How are you? Good to see you. Oh, 
<laughs> and then there's this one. This one sells great ice cream. Also, look what's available. So we'll just see how many that we can we can see. I'm going to turn it off for a second because I'm not going to see any for until I make the corner up here. And we're back, and here's another one. Load Nadito, all networks, ice candy, P2, two pesos long, two pesos long. And then this, here's another one. <laughs> Fish balls, cheese sticks, jumbo hot dogs, eat log, eggs, and right across the street, we have another one. Anybody counting? They have a bunch of birds here too. Pretty cool. Anybody counting? How many sorry sorry stores are we up to? <laughs> I'm actually on my way to the hardware store to see if I can get a can of WD-40. Uh, a little bummed out about that BC Cleta that I bought at SNR for my daughter Ira Mae. It is rusting everywhere. <clears throat> I'm just so surprised, you know. Everywhere that there's chrome, the chrome is turning to rust. And, uh, you know, we've had that bike not even two months. So I think the only way I can slow it down is maybe add some WD 40 to a bunch of the parts. I'm going to try that and see. And also, my uh, the motorcycle uh, chain needs some lube, so we're gonna. I'm gonna go to head down to the hardware store here and see if I can see if I can get a can of WD-40. But I just wanted to show you the stores just in a short walking distance. Okay, so back in a minute. Here's another one. Ice and ice too big for sale. Then right across the street is this other store. French fries. Load all networks. And the menu. Can't shut it off yet because right around the corner from that one. is also another sorry sorry right here there you go how about that so what happens is you know each sorry sorry store or some sorry sorry stores are known for certain things okay and then you have some that are like this one up here. This one's a combination. Sorry, sorry, and a mini palinque. Let's have a look at it. Kind of handy to have, right? Very close to home. So we're kind of 
walking over here towards the, the hot panda sound. Still very close to home. We're still within Filipino walking distance to the house. Goodbye. <laughs> And I'll turn it back on. Here's another one. Good morning. Another store. I forgot about this one. This one's got school supplies. And here's a little restaurant. Almost forgot about those. Anybody keep them count? How many we're at right now? I'm not. Good morning. I have a YouTube channel about North Caloocan. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's a YouTube channel. People are interested to see what life is like here, you know, so I show them on YouTube. <laughs> Thank you. And another one. And it's not all sorry, sorry. You have videoki for rent here. Okay. It's me. <laughs> Hello. Boy. You're the business owner? Yeah. Okay. How many videokis do you have? I have three videokis. Three total? Yeah. And Makano Po? 700 only. Uh, and how many hours? 24 hours. 24 hours yeah. for 700. Yeah. Okay. Thank you. <laughs> there you go. 700 for 24 hours. Videoki, those are the big ones too. A lot of people rent those for parties. And here's another mini Halinke. Good morning. Good morning. <coughs> and a sow. And that was just, that's just a short walking distance here. So another one. Pretty cool little coffee machine. Nice. And that's not it, guys. It's not just all sorry, sorry stores. You know, some of these places are little restaurants. You can go in and sit down and have, have a bowl of food. Another one. Good morning. <laughs> Barber shop. Little eat dog shop. I think that's a, is that a T-Max? Oh, it's an N-Max. Yamaha, that's a nice bike. Yamaha makes a T-Max that's 550 cc's. It's a monster for a scooter. the endless. Oh, there's another one. I forgot about that one. Good 
morning. So now I want to walk across the bridge to the other side, over towards Senate Village. That's where the hardware store is. And uh, we'll see how many stores there are over there. Anybody counting? <laughs> More in a minute. Hey, and the river has receded. So look at the trash everywhere, you guys. My God. Yeah, it's probably down two foot from what it was before. Just nasty. Oh my God. Good morning. How are you? YouTube. Wow, YouTube. Yeah. Popo, yeah. Gumagawa ko ng video. Sa YouTube. Salamat po. That was another minute little pilinke. Here's another, sorry, sorry, with rice. Good morning. Hello. <laughs> another panda salad dealer right here on the corner. Another barber shop here. Another sorry, sorry store here. And then next door to that's the hardware store. So I need to go see if they've got, uh, I need to see if they've got WD-40 here. This is our hardware store. Hello, Po. Meron ba kayo ng WD-40? We got a little bit of everything. Uh, Makano. One sixty-five. One sixty-five mali eat and the bullet and roma. Wait long. All right, got it. One hundred ninety pesos, Daba. For the Malaki. There's another store. I don't know how much it is at uh, Palinque or at uh, Changet. Another store. So, you know, the point of this whole thing was uh, you can go really actually a long time here, guys, without a car. If you're living in an area like this. Oh, junk shop. And he actually goes through the neighborhood every day on a, uh, on a bike.
bike with a cart attached to it so he comes to your house and hauls the junk away. So you have all these options, you know, close to home. We can decide at the spur of the moment that we want pork barbecue or something and just walk and get it. So simple and reasonably priced, you know. <clears throat> and that's where I get my hair cut, right there. <laughs> And there's another store right there. Mommy Stores, you can see that. So it's just endless. You know? <laughs> I don't know what the sorry star sorry sorry store count was, but it, it's big. It, they're everywhere. Morning ladies. Hello. How are you? Good morning. <laughs> you just walking? Lag a lag. lag a lag. I wanted to uh, show you guys this. Uh, this is another way for us to go, you know, to go to the gym. And I found another full court basketball covered just up here that I didn't know existed. We just found it this morning. So cool. I didn't even know it was here. And what do you got there? Yep. Another store. <laughs> I didn't count. Oh, here's a bummer. Hey, you see that a lot. But hey, check this out. Another basketball court. How cool is that? I didn't even know this one was here. Okay, so within walking distance of my home, there's four that are just like this one that are covered. There's two full courts that are uncovered. And then there's the single hoop that you see me play with, with the kids on where we play. So uh, it's just endless. Filipinos love their basketball, man. How cool is that? All right. That's it for now. I just wanted to show you guys uh, the different shopping options that I had within just a few, you know, probably four or five square blocks of walking. You've got all of those stores. And not only are they... Not only are they... Uh, Sorry, sorry stores during the day. Uh, about about 4 p.m. they all convert, a lot of them, probably half of them convert to barbecue stands. You know, where you can buy the barbecue sticks with, you know, pork and chicken intestine and uh, various other tasty meat treats. All right, guys, that's all for now. We'll do a little bit more later. And also our uh, a phrase of the day. I'll have to do the intro with that. See you later. Philo in the Philippines. Your roving North Cal Oaken reporter, signing off.